And then again, we are working on our um, flutter sleeve vest, which looks like this, so adorable. I just want to squeeze that little baby girl. She's so precious. She's adorable. I just want to squeeze her cheeks. <laughs> anyway, this is a free pattern on the Bernat website. Go to www.bernat.com and do a search for the flutter sleeve vest. And you'll find this pattern. It's a crochet pattern. And it's considered an intermediate pattern because of all of the different stitches that you'll have to do. If you're unfamiliar with some of these stitches, you'll see them described in the abbreviations. But also, they are described in detail as you work each line of the pattern. Right now, we're working the third row. We finished the first and the second row, and we're starting the third row. And it starts off with a chain two. And just so you know, we're using Bernat Giggles yarn in the color Oh Sunny Day and we're using a size H crochet hook. So we're starting the third row now with chain two. One, two. Next we do one half double crochet in the first half double crochet. So that's right here, right at the very beginning. So we do a half double crochet there. Next it says chain one. No it doesn't. I'm looking at the wrong row. Now it says two half double crochets in the next chain one space. So here's where you have to pay attention to your spaces. See the spaces that we made earlier? Those are the spaces that they're talking about. So it says do two half double crochets in the chain one space. So we're going to go right into the middle of the space. Pull out some yarn. get me for a while. So now I need to do one more half double crochet in that same space because we're supposed to do two half double crochets in the space. Next it says one half double crochet in the next half double crochet. So you get right at the top of that half double crochet and do one there. Next it says to just repeat that same two things all the way across the row. So I'm going to be doing two half double crochets in this space and then one half double crochet on top of a half double crochet. Two in the space, one there, two in the space, one there. So it's not too hard for this row. This is a simple row. So just go all the way into that space for your two and then just work your half double crochet right at the top of the half double crochet from the previous row. And that's the way it works all the way across. So that's row three. So I'll see you in the next video for row four. Row three is easy. You don't need to see me do the whole thing. <laughs> Talk to you later. Bye.